Hi everybody, Anthony Papillon here, and I just wrote and posted a blog article about Word or Office 2007, and it occurred to me after posting it that not everybody's going to want to spend the, the time to download the 400 megabyte demo file, um, or waste the hard disk space in what's going to probably be a near gigabyte installation. So I thought I would just create a video and post it here on YouTube, showing you the cool new user interface of Office 2007, and kind of explaining to you um, why I think it's so great. I mean, I'm really excited about it. I, I think it's the best thing probably since the introduction of Office for, uh, well, I think it's Office 2003 that looked so good. Um, it was just a leap forward in UI interface and I think this is too. So the first thing you'll notice, I have an Office, I actually have Word open here and uh, that's predominantly the application people use um, whenever it's whenever they use Office. Um, yeah, there are people that use Excel and um, Access and Outlook and PowerPoint, but most home users predominantly use Word to type letters, do recipes, do business work, um, that type of thing. So that's what we're going to use for our demo. The, the interface for all the other programs um, are pretty much the same. It's a nice unified look and feel. Um, so if you want to explore that a little bit more, I invite you to go to Microsoft.com and download the, uh, the full demo and that way you can play around with all the programs. But uh, we're just going to stick with Word here. So the first thing you're going to notice is that the user interface looks a lot different than any other version of Office you might have seen before. Um, the menu system is replaced by what's called the ribbon. Microsoft calls it the fluid user interface or fluent user interface. Um, and it's exactly what it sounds like. It only, Each tab, and these are the tabs up here, only have the options that are most commonly used by users. Um, so it ignores all of the other stuff that I might never use um, when using an Office application and it only puts the good stuff there. So for example, if I want to do page layout, I don't want to have to go through 15 or 16 different menu items. I want just some common stuff. So I click the page layout tab and it immediately brings me to the layout ribbon, which of course has the most common uh, things I'm going to use. Like there's my indent, my spacing, um, margins, def uh, the orientation, the paper size, everything I might want to use. And you'll notice it takes a very little screen real estate. It's really, really nicely laid out. Um, same thing if I want to go to, um, let's say like my insert mode, um, I can do also, I can insert all sorts of stuff like a page, break a blank page, uh, a chart, whatever. But again, it's always the common stuff that I would use um, when creating an office document that's there. It's none of the other garbage. Um, so that's that. Now, now the menus are still there. They're not gone totally. And if you do need that level of fine control, um, there's this nice little button up here called the uh, called the Office button, and it contains most of the other options that used to be in the old menu system. Um, you can click it, and you'll see it slides out. Um, there's for new document. There's to open document, save, save as. And when you click save as, of course, it brings up all sorts of. Uh, options for saving because you can save it as a regular Word document which is in, in, in Office 2007 um, is an XML is a zipped XML file um, and of course you know Office 97 to 2003 doesn't support zipped XML so you will have to save it as another format and that's able to be done here you can have like a Office or Word 2007 or 97 to 2003 um, a Word template or just a regular Word document for Office 2007 you can also do probably 50 other document formats here. Um, you'll also notice that I mean it, it's very sleek, very nice. Highlighting color schemes are very nice, and uh, it, it's just really, really an easy and fun application to use. So with that, I'm going to cut this demonstration short because I don't want to burden you with all the intricacies. But if you do want to know more, I invite you to go to www.microsoft.com/office and download the full demo. You'll love it. I guarantee it.